Good morning, beautiful people. Welcome back to my channel. I hope you guys are all doing well. Do you know we have 92 days left in spring? And spring is one of my favorite seasons. I think that that is enough time for us to add pieces to our wardrobe and um, still just hop on some of the spring trends. We have a lot to talk about, so I'll try to move quickly through the video. And what I'll do is I'll talk about a trend and then I will link a couple of options down in the description box if you are interested. All right, let's talk about it. You know, I kind of fought the silver and gold trend as it was moving in you know I've never been a big silver gold accessory type girl but I've fallen into it it just gives your outfit just a certain look and people are rocking these silver and gold bags silver and gold shoes and it looks so good especially with denim so <laughs> like I said I fell into the trend this bag is from Zara and it is the cutest bag it just looks so good with my outfits it's a smaller bag right because if you go too big with silver or gold sometimes it's it's a bit overwhelming I will link this down for you guys and maybe a few other options for you if you're interested but I'm falling in love with this trend and like I said before in my videos pops of color give like that oh there's a pop in our outfit and it kind of brings the outfit to life it's the same thing for a silver gold any of the metallics like it does the same thing so if you are into silver or gold maybe you've always been into that silver and gold bags the shoes the belts I think you should fully embrace this trend because it looks so good and like I said when you have denim on this just elevates it right you can take a regular casual outfit into something special just by adding like a silver handbag or a pair of silver heels and it just looks so good not to mention what you can do with your jewelry <laughs> with this so this is the first trend that we were talking about the first thing i think you need to add into your wardrobe a silver or gold bag okay i'm gonna throw in a bonus item into this video because while we are talking about the silver and gold handbags we have to talk about the shoes i mentioned these in my previous video these are from christian louboutin they are sold out right now so i can link some other options for you but you throw this on with a pair of denim jeans you throw a silver heel on with a pair of white jeans with a little black dress it just completely changes the outfit and let me show you what it looks like with that Zara bag come on so if you are wearing denim if you are wearing a solid color and you pair this with this it's just like a game changer this is the pop that you need for your outfit this spring okay we're gonna talk about the color black again because I know that a lot of people have just black clothing in their closet and I want you to be able to reach for what's in your closet or go and get something that you can get your cost per wear you can wear throughout the season Seasons, and black is just that color it's the chicest color to me and I just want people to embrace it and find ways to embrace it throughout the year so um, I did talk about you know black during spring and I, somebody made a comment that you know black can be seen as like a boring color and the way to do it in my opinion for spring is to get something that has some detail right the details are everything you see these black cutout shirts you see like ruffles you see even feathers you see rhinestones sparkly shirts you can do that and then wear it during spring and it gives your outfit that extra something this one is from Express I'm gonna pop a picture up just so you can see it because you just have to see it in a picture it's such a beautiful shirt and it gives the illusion that we have flowers on our arms across our chest on our shoulders you can wear it across your arms or you can wear it up however whatever suits you best but the shirt is just beautiful even if you want that floral feel for spring this shirt gives it to you it comes in other colors but I really love it in black the reason why I love black again is because you can pair it with any color so if you're trying to your pop a color if you have that bag that's just that bright color your pair of shoes you cannot go wrong with black and like I said black is usually in in people's closets right you just gotta reach for it but if you are saying I don't want to be boring I do want to hop on the like you know wearing black through spring and summer trend try this shirt try shirts that have these kind of like you know girly feminine floral patterns on them um, or details on them and I think it's a win okay next I'm gonna talk about pants Pants, but just bear with me because I know you either love or hate this but just listen to hear me out white pants okay either the denim option or the linen white pants nothing screams spring and summer like a pair of nice crisp white pants you can pair them with so many colors you can uh, pair it with so many different tops you really will get your cost per wear with a pair of white pants I like high rise I don't like really low rise um, pants in general but they just really don't look good and white to me but if you want to do your ballet flats if you want to get that classic look you have to have a pair of white pants I don't like white pants with like vibrant colors I like to pair my white pants with like 
black i love white and black together or a softer color or a neutral or a pastel color it just looks so good so if you are not into like a lot of vibrant colors but you like you know your tans and your creams get a pair of white pants trust me okay another trend that we have to talk about is the denim skirt now in my last video i did talk about my long denim skirt and how we're seeing like the midi the maxi denim skirts even the mini denim skirts are in it's just denims everywhere so i love this i talked about this one before this one is from express um, but it is a gray denim. I think that denim is one of those things that you can dress down or dress up. And I love the fact that we are embracing denim, denim shoes, denim bags, because it gives you a lot of versatility in your closet. So even if you're not into the blue denim, I wanted to talk about this because gray denim is also in. Um, I've seen a lot of like white jean skirts going on, like the Bermuda shorts are coming back. Just grab a denim skirt. You'll see I paired this one with a black top, some black heels, if I wanted to dress it down, I could throw on a white t-shirt, some espadrilles, some cute sneakers, some flats. So much that you can do with denim. And like I said, you can definitely reach for gray because that is in too. Speaking of denim, I mentioned denim bags, right? Denim shoes, denim bags. I've reached for this Zara bag every time I wear a light colored denim. I love it because it has like gold and silver on the chain. So you can like mix and match your jewelry or, you know, the belt buckle or you know your shoes and it gives this kind of like light blue denim jean color but we are now in the the spring trend of denim bags and i love it because i just love the look of it i love the look of just like a cute shirt your denim and your bag that matches the denim and the bags are just super super cute so i am looking to purchase a denim bag i am still going to keep the zara one because i think that it is so cute but i'm going to list some options for you if you want to hop on this trend or you have been looking for you know a denim club denim bag I have a couple of options for you a couple of things in mind and again it's super cute for spring I don't know about you but I am so happy that statement earrings are back because for a moment it was all about the studs the small dainty earrings which I'm a fan of those too but I love a good bold earring right now Bottega has everybody in a chokehold with the earring and it's a beautiful earring but Zara Zara and that floral earring that they came out with it just stole my heart I do have a pair of statement earrings that I wear in every Every time I wear them, I'll put a picture up so you can see a close up. Every time I wear these earrings, people want to know where I got them. And I got them from Amazon and they cannot believe it. Side note, Amazon has just a lot of good jewelry options. I'll link these if they're still available if you guys are interested. But these big floral earrings that make a statement, they're big, they're there, kind of in your face and they're beautiful earrings. I am in love. I think they're perfect for spring. You can work them into summer. They frame your face, especially if you wear your hair behind your ear or even if you wear it down they're so big that you can see them i just love it i love the way that they look so if you are into big bold earrings i will link a couple of options for you guys i know sometimes people can feel like they can be a little overwhelming are they heavy is it too much but to me they just look so good you know short hair long hair you can wear a big bold earring and it'll be so on trend for spring all right so i mentioned a pop of color in your outfit adding a pop of color and maybe you're saying like okay cool i want to do that how do i do that I love adding colorful skirts to my outfits because I wear a lot of bodysuits. Like I said, I have a lot of like black tops. I have a lot of cream tops. I feel like skirts are like that way to add the pop of colors where you don't have to do like your whole outfit in that one color this one is from express i love it so much it's one of my favorite skirts you will see that i paired this with a black blazer and i think a pair of black shoes again it was during my when i did my days of fashion but i paired it with black and i love this look i get asked about this skirt a lot just because of the color you guys know that this vibrant hot pink color is just in right now it is everywhere so if you're looking for a way to add color to your outfit and you're into skirts definitely reach for the color that you're looking for whether you want to do orange or yellow try to find it in a skirt just because you can kind of tone it down with the top and the shoes and the bag skirts aren't your thing and you want to look for pants in the color do that i'll link some options for you so you can check them out okay if i can be honest okay on this channel which i try to be very honest on my channel right i try to wear the things that i wear like out or I tell you guys about things that i would purchase myself i am just not 
not a sneaker person. There are a couple of sneakers that I like and I think are cute, but I'm by no means a sneaker girl. So I reach for espadrilles when I need to go out and I want to give it that look. I just feel like espadrilles are the best way to do that. So I have my two favorite. I have this pair of Gucci espadrilles. They have a floral print. I usually wear these during spring and summer just because they're so colorful and I can pull from any color that's an issue. So we got yellow, we got red, we got pink. I hold on to these like they're from a couple of seasons ago but I hold on to them because I can just wear so much with these. I've talked about these at length. <laughs> these are my Chanel espadrilles and they are a navy blue and white. When I'm going for that like classic look I love to reach for these. So again if you're not a sneaker person but you want to wear flats and you still want to look stylish and you want to hop on some of the trends I think espadrilles are just always in. They're always a win and if I can be honest they are something that you can wear throughout the year right. Espadrilles have been in for years and they will continue to be in for years. I mentioned a pair of white Tory Burch espadrilles in my last video. So I'm talking about espadrilles because I think that you can do so much with the color. So we're talking about spring trends and I love these white espadrilles for spring because we are wearing a lot of white shirts. We are wearing a lot of flowy dresses, a lot of denim. And again, you can wear these white espadrilles and throw on almost any color with them, right? Because you're going to pair it with like a pair of black pants or your denim skirts. If you're wearing all white, you can do that too with a pair of white pants and a white top. I just feel like the versatility of espadrilles is unmatched, okay? And you guys hear me say that a lot, but what I say that about is true. You can reach for espadrilles and just completely turn a regular outfit from just a casual outfit to casual chic or oh that's so cute. So these white espadrilles from Tory Burch are perfect for spring and they will go with any spring outfit. Okay so I've talked about white shirts a lot on this channel because I feel like they're seasonal. You can rock them throughout the whole year and you'll get your cost per wear from them and they come in so many different styles. What I love from spring and what I'm seeing a lot already are people are just taking their white t-shirts and they are rocking the white t-shirts with different pairs pairs of jeans, different types of jeans. We've seen so many denim options this season and I'm so excited but then you'll look up and somebody will have on like you know a white t-shirt that has a cutout or puffy sleeves. You'll see different shirts with like rhinestones and jewels just to, to add details. So what I'm gonna do is add some options for you guys. If you are looking for a white tee that has just something different, you don't want to wear a plain white t-shirt because that can make your outfit look just too casual. You want to wear the white tee, get that look but you want something extra. In this picture I got this white t-shirt from H&M but I love the sleeves right. They're puffy sleeves but you can pull them down. You can push them up just to make them like really really big but the material is just a plain white t-shirt but do you see how it changes the look so like I said I'll link some options for you if you are into white t-shirts last but definitely not least the colorful bag okay we're talking about pops of color I cannot have this video without talking about a colorful bag this one is from Kurt Geiger I already had questions on it it is sold out I randomly found this bag in Nordstrom okay I don't even remember when I got it but I had to get it just because of this mustard yellow color I use this as like my pop of color with my outfits but it doesn't have to be this yellow color if you're not into it it can be the pink bags it can be a different shade of yellow it can be an orange bag it could be a vibrant blue bag right Fendi just came out with the, this bag that has just sold several colors but it, it's still that pop of color that you need for your outfit so imagine you do your little black dress or you do your white sundress or whatever dress you're doing for spring and you rock this bag or you have your pop of color that matches your shoes or matches your belt it is just a look so you need a pop of color and I think that you can do it with your bag if you're not into like you know Jasmine I don't want to be overwhelming I don't like you know just wearing pink and yellow like that add your pop of color with your bag or your shoes this spring it'll look so good okay beautiful people that is it those are my items that I think that you need in your spring wardrobe this 2023 season most of these items are in your closet and you can take them into summer which is the goal so I hope you you got some inspiration from this video and if you like these types of videos please don't forget to like and subscribe I upload videos twice a week with all that being said I will see you in the next one Mwah.